We're a team. All of us. This happened on my watch, and I'll need help to fix it. No one fights alone. Now, there's a lot of awesome characters filled within the world of Modern Warfare, and not many of them are more iconic than Simon Ghost Riley. But to be quite honest with you, I don't know what's going on with this character. It seems like he had a big push in Modern Warfare 2, but after that, he really took a backseat. And with the mess that was Modern Warfare 3, he kind of just disappeared into the background. Kind of like Sergeant Gas, but he'll be a topic for another video. Now, I think Ghost is a character that can be used very well, and the franchise could get a lot out of him story-wise if it's done correctly and i kind of sort of mentioned this in my story video regarding uh lieutenant ghost see i don't know how much of the current modern warfare series we have left but ghost could get a spin-off if he continues to survive the games and we could get a modern retelling of the call of duty ghost game with lieutenant simon ghost riley in the lead but i know i guess that sounds like i'm getting a little bit ahead of myself so for more information on the immediate future of Ghost, I think Lieutenant Ghost deserves a much bigger role in Modern Warfare 4. And this is specifically due to the relationship that he had with Sergeant Soap. Perfect show, LT. You called it, Sergeant. I think Ghost could go on an arc where he begins to question some of the methods of Captain Price or kind of goes rogue and chases after Makarov himself. As we know that the lieutenant is incredibly capable when it comes to clandestine work. This would continue to elevate the mystique of his character while also adding conflict within the 141, which would show the impact that Makarov is having within the squad and also make Soap death a little bit more meaningful because as it stands right now, it hasn't served much of a purpose. Now, I think Simon Ghost Riley needs to have a big impact on the next game. If he doesn't, then Modern Warfare can truly suffer from this and actually potentially just die. Because look, Modern Warfare 3 was terrible and it almost killed the series completely when it comes to the story and campaign only. Modern Warfare 2 may have not been for everyone, but Modern Warfare 3 was for no one. And the reason I say this is because Call of Duty cannot survive another situation like Modern Warfare 3 with Modern Warfare 4. They can't have two massive f**k-ups in a row. So they need to sit back, assess everything, the situation, how to write this story, and be honest with themselves. They need to make a story that is worthy of the Modern Warfare series and maybe kind of ground it again like they did with modern warfare 2019 the game should concentrate on the remaining members of task force one for one which are gas ghost and captain price and when i say the remaining members i'm talking about the main core that is the main core of task force one for one so i think they should have a big role to play in modern warfare 4 and the story should follow them almost exclusively and I do have high hopes for Ghost in future games. I'm really hoping that Call of Duty can do him justice and give him the spotlight that I think he deserves. Because as of now, he only had one significant impact in this rebooted series, and that was in Modern Warfare 2. So his return so far has been pretty lackluster.